Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all had the best Christmas and are enjoying this kind of Christmas limbo period that we're in. I uh, skipped, you may have noticed I didn't do a video on Wednesday. It was just obviously we're in the thick of hosting for Christmas. We're also hosting for New Year's. So I think what I will do is um, obviously I wanted to get this video up for you guys close to Christmas, a bit of a what I got for Christmas video. And then next week with it being, it's also my birthday, which I will vlog. And also what else is there? Tom's going away as well. So spend some time with him. The madness after hosting, get the house in order. I will vlog it all, but those vlogs probably won't be live until I'm thinking I'll probably come back next Sunday. That's probably when I will have my first video back for you guys for 2024. Can we believe it? Um, but yeah, for today, I just wanted to sit down and share with you as I do every Christmas, a bit of a what I got for Christmas video. Just a bit of a disclaimer that some of these items, well, I'm not gonna say who's got me what, I'm just gonna show you what I've got. But also I have got some PR bits in here that I was sent over the Christmas period that some of the brands that I've worked with over the past year, years, previous years, or brands that wanted to send PR, they've also included a few bits as well. So there's quite a few things to share with you. I also have my birthday close to Christmas so a lot of the time I get kind of like joint gifts or um <clears throat> main gifts for this time and then just something little for my birthday so anyway I'm gonna jump into sharing with you what I got if you haven't already make sure you're set and cozy with a nice leftover cheese board cheese and crackers some celebrations and a coffee in hand whatever it is in your pjs like i have been living in mine and let's get into today's video first and foremost chocolates we had quite a few this year and gillian is a trusty favorite in this household one of my favorites and look at the size of that box huge also got from goldsmiths a very lovely surprise of these earrings um so tom actually bought me these i will say that but they are so, so pretty. I love wearing these kind of huggy style small hoop earrings. And I was saying to Tom, the ones that I've got from Anna Luisa, which you guys know I love, I have had for a long time and I would like a bit of an upgrade. So he upgraded and treated me, absolutely spoiled me with these earrings. Got a beautiful small business actually that um, I showed my mum and it's called Salt or Salt Home. They do some gorgeous things and so as a kind of like joint gift for myself and Tom we got this set um which is just beautiful I know I said I'm not saying who's got me what but <laughs> so far I've told you exactly who's got me what this box full of goodies is just me all over so first and foremost this beautiful bowl it's just like a paper mache bowl which is Perfect for throwing some Christmas chocolates in at this time of the year, Easter chocolates at Easter, having a standalone just like on a bookshelf on some coffee table books, just as like a nice decor piece. That boxed up and safe until I find a home for it. Um, and then also within here, we got this set of organic olive oil and balsamic vinegar. How again, aesthetic. You can see how beautiful the packaging is. So this is Le Marque, uh, Organic olive oil from Sicily and balsamic vinegar, 15 year barrel aged from Italy. With Tommy, a chef of the household, he is gonna love that. And then we've got these which come packaged like so. This is the, I think the salt mill. And this is a pepper mill, which are in like an antique brass. And I've mentioned these as well because I've seen them before and I just think they're beautiful. So we've got our Le Creuset ones, which we love using. But these to have out on our kitchen shelf next to, or, or like on the island, maybe on the little tray next to cooking. These ones are just so beautiful and they age with time. So they get more and more, a bit like our like switches and sockets that we've gone for from uh, Causton. They age over time and become even more antique looking. And lastly within this gift set um, is this beautiful, these are all, I think they said like handmade, handcrafted, individual, really old boards. Even just for on display, beautiful. Or I've got some of these where I have like a candle on them, one of the big botanical candles or something. So loads of different uses for that, but um, yeah, we'll find a home for that. And I'll show you that once it's in place, that's sort of, 
styling content and everything to come in the new year. I also got from the White Company, I got one of these individual winter candles. So I'll get that burning. I love winter. It's just such a classic, even into January, I like burning winter as well. So love that. And then also from the White Company, this gorgeous, it's like a silk, 100% um, silk sleep from sleep range at the White Company. It's like a headband. Can you see it's in like a navy with little uh, diamonds that you can obviously use as a sleep hairband. You could use it to like maybe throw your hair up while you're doing your makeup. And then also I got these festive, well I say festive, but it's just because they've got stars on it. But these joggers from, again, the White Company sleep range or lounge range, they call them, in a small. And these ones are part wool and with cashmere as well. I think I've seen that they do navy and also a grey on their website. But yeah, they're just like a nice lightweight lounge jogger to wear around the house that are so comfy. And yeah, gorgeous for the festive season with the stars that any time of year. And then also from the White Company, I got one of their Christmassy mugs. They do a star and a snowflake. The snowflake is my favorite. Maybe we could get one of each, but this snowflake mug, which is perfect for Christmas within, I think my next video, I'll probably do it as well. Within the next couple of videos, I want to do a pantry organize and I'm gonna have a good declutter and clear out of especially seasonal mugs because let's face it, we only need a few. <laughs> And I have a whole shelf full of seasonal mugs, autumn and winter. It's just my weakness is buying seasonal mugs. But I'm going to whittle it down to all of my favourites. And this obviously will be up there with one of my most favourite. So yeah. Also to make some hot chocolates, we got some Hotel Chocolat. This is the Selection Everything box. And to go with it, some bar slabs of the 40% milk chocolate okay this was actually a treat from me to me it was something that i had an amazon voucher to put towards something and i thought you know what i'm gonna buy myself something this year it's a bit of a well done do think that is something that we should all do we should pat ourselves on the back when we feel like we deserve it and just have a bit of guilt free treat yourself so i treated myself to i've mentioned this before that i wanted it but the Home Alone house. And Tom looked at me and said, are you crazy? Where on earth are we gonna put that? But he's got several Lego cars and they don't take up that much space. But I'm thinking with this one to, I'm not sure when I'll get around to doing it. I was thinking this festive period, but honestly, we've been that busy hosting, organizing the house, doing stuff that I feel like I haven't even cracked this open yet. I haven't even got a puzzle out this year. That's how much I feel like I need to just that's what I'm saying. This week, I'm just gonna skip another video and just have a bit of time to myself and do stuff like this. But yeah, I was thinking this could be something that we could bring out each year as a bit of Christmas decor, because it's like a proper little house that you can open up and like a kind of doll's house and be part of the Christmas decor as Home Alone is within my top three Christmas movies. This was an absolute treat, absolute treat. I did choose it so i knew i was getting it tom and i both kind of did a gift this year whereby of a similar value we decided to kind of each pick our own thing and he got a ramoa suitcase and i got i got a bag went for a brown like the classic kind of monogram from louis vuitton like this i think is the bag yeah this one's the bag so they packaged it beautifully for Christmas. Some really gorgeous Christmas gift wrap this year and even the bags as well, love them. So this is called the Pochette Felici. Those of you that follow me on Instagram may have noticed quite a few months ago now, I shared a Pinterest image that I'd seen and I said, does anyone know what this bag is? And a few of you guys have said, you've got it, this is what it is. So this is it, she is gorgeous. And she's kind of like, this is me girl mathing, three in one, because not only do you get the actual bag itself, which comes with the gold chain kind of crossbody, which makes it a little dressier, which you can clip off so you can have it as a clutch. And also within here, you get a couple of inserts. So you get this one, as you can tell, the like um, kind of burgundy inner is beautiful. But you get this insert, which is like a little card and money holder. And then you also get this zippable 
pouch as well. So again, another coin purse or whatever you want to put in here where you want to put like little bits of makeup or something to like have separate within the bag. I was after, as well as this option of the chain, they do a leather chain to make it a bit more daytime appropriate, which again, you just simply clip on. Again, beautiful Christmas packaging. We've got lots of boxes and Christmas packaging here, which I am just, ooh, I feel like I'm, it's Christmas again, opening everything. Bag within a box, within a box, within a bag. So this is the leather strap. I'm assuming this is like obviously compatible with quite a few of their bags, but you can adjust it with this buckle to have it crossbody. And like I said, to have this one, I just feel like makes it a bit more daytime appropriate, which is probably how I will wear this most often. And then a friend bought me the cutest, most sentimental, thoughtful little print, which is just so cute. It's even got like me and Barney on it, as you can tell. And it just says, a true friend leaves poor prints forever on your heart. Love that. I also got some gorgeous PJs, these satiny, silky, um, this is actually a set, so you get a shirt, you get the um, eye mask as well as the bottoms, and it's a really nice print. I don't know if you'll be able to see it on camera, but it's kind of like a slight animal print. That's another area I want to clear out. Bit of a declutter and clear out of my uh, PJ drawer, especially now that I've got these new ones because not only did I get those, but I also got some from, where are they? So here we go. I've also been given some from the White Company. We love White Company PJs. From the Sleep Range White Company. They're like a soft brushed cotton ribbed white bottom and matching top. So very me, just classic, simple. Just love, 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 love. And then also, also from the white company, I got some cozy socks. And I love getting new socks at Christmas. So these nice little boot socks are perfect for this time of the year. Again, another drawer that I wanna have a clear out of. I got some little stocking fillers, some palm reading cards. I just feel like apparently this, these kind of things like tarot cards, palm reading cards, it's bad luck if you buy them yourself. And I've always wanted some, so we've got some little palm reading cards. We can maybe do that together in a vlog or something. Discover your future in the palm of your hands. We also got a little addresses and birthdays book, a hand warmer, rechargeable for dog walks in the winter weather. Um, I also got some wooden dominoes, which we actually played. So they're down in the like black bookcase room with the games. But I've also, Tom's been teaching me chess over the Christmas period. So I had a game with my dad as well and I just, not very good, but we're learning. Um, but yeah, I've got sets of, with the dominoes, also some black playing cards. Like how smart is that Joker card? So we'll get those in the kind of like games room, games area in that bookcase. Everyone knows me very well. I've got no excuse now. We've got chocolates to last the month of January. <laughs> anyway, this as well is something that I did mention to family and friends saying like, if you are struggling for ideas, this would be amazing. And I got it and I'm so happy I did because this is just the most gorgeous coffee table photo album. It's called A Dog's Life. It's in like a linen, white and beige that is just perfect on display in any of our rooms, quite frankly. These are from Printworks, which I've bought their albums before because I think they're really good um, as gift ideas. They do all sorts. They do like wedding albums. They do, I've included some in gift guides in the past as well because they do a, um, something like, I think it's called an artist's work or something like that, whereby you can use it to put your child's artwork within, you know, like the paintings, the drawings, things that they come home from school with. And you're a bit like, thanks, but where do I put it? All of this stuff. To have it all within like one of those albums that's a really nice coffee table book. I think it's genius. And then I also got this from Hotel Chocolat. This is a dipping adventure. They do some of these, um, I've seen these before, like little pots where you can melt the chocolate and have a little 
like fondue set. I also got a, from Oliver Bonus, an aroma diffuser. This is gorgeous. So you guys know I love to have my electric diffusers. So I feel like I could have one in every room. But this one is beautiful. Let me show you, because I want to show you the color of it. It's gorgeous. I feel like because of the green, it would work perfectly in, I would say the downstairs loop, but there's no plug socket in there. So I'm gonna say like the kitchen area, pantry kitchen pantry or even entryway if we get some kind of like little console there i feel like that would look really nice um there so yeah love that oh another really thoughtful gift that tom bought which i'm really excited for is a girl that is local to us and um, she does at home one-to-one -one yoga sessions so she sent this as the kind of like little gift to open um of which in here is a little peppermint tea kind of like a wellness box gratitude journal which i've seen this before and i wanted to get it so there's that there's a chamomile tea a little green clay mask and some essential oils in white jasmine within here is a voucher for yoga with sophie and she will be coming to our house for me and tom to both have a kind of like private one-to-one -one session yoga session for an hour every week for i think it's 12 weeks he said he's booked so sort of january to march time which we can obviously extend if we decide to or spread it out if we wanted to but i thought that was lovely because i really i always say to him i really want to get more into yoga i also want to try like some pilates or something this year but yeah i thought that was perfect actually to kickstart the new year okay this is something i've actually just bought myself for new years as we are hosting i'm thinking getting a little glam so i bought um myself something from nadine marabi to wear which is their it's like a jumpsuit in this like vel velvet with the feather topper which is so gorgeous i feel like i can't show you properly without it being on. So I'll do a kind of like unboxing try on of that over on my Instagram if you wanna see. I'm gonna be doing more styling videos to come, so stay tuned for those. And last but not least, we've got some more PR bits, things that have been sent. This, which I thought was genius. I've mentioned these kind of things before, but from Ultra Human, this is called their Air. This is the ring sizing kit that you can get. And it's essentially like a smart ring, so it can track your sleep pattern, stress, all sorts of things. And you basically get this little ring sizer, tell them your size, and then they send it to you in the post in different colors that they do. I went for, if I show you, I thought this would be really interesting to try so it fits on your index finger i went for the gold but you can get black silver i think they do silver and matte black as well i also got a garmin because i actually went on a run today but i really want to be able to track my running and my like um pace time i take barney as well so i have my phone in my pouch it's really awkward to get out to see what time i'm on and everything so i also got one of these which i bought from tiktok shop along with buying one for my dad for christmas i thought i would get one for myself i love a good mystery kind of game i love true crime so these um case files that x detectives have created where you get all the information included and you basically have to suss out who's the murderer. Bobby Brown very kindly sent me a little Christmas PR package, which is just so kind of them. So thank you to Bobby Brown for sending this over. In here, a mascara and the instant long wear makeup remover. We've got a double set. This is one of my favorite products from Bobby Brown. It's their vitamin enriched face base, like a good real like thick, smells amazing as well, primer for your face. Um, and this is their Luxe Cheek and Highlight Palette. Luxe Matte Lipstick. Again, in a vlog, we can maybe try these out and do some like makeup reviews, first impression type things. Another lipstick here and a little eyeshadow duo. What a treat, I can't wait to try all these out. And then last thing in this sack, we've got some bits from Giorgio Armani. So their makeup is gorgeous, especially their Luminous Silk Foundation. So they have sent me a top up, which is in my shade three. Perfect, one of my favorite foundations. It's like three is perfect for when I have my winter skin. So maybe a little bit of tanning drops in my skin, but otherwise, like in my moisturizer, otherwise just kind of like the color I am now. I haven't really got any tan on at the moment. But then they also sent a couple of their eye tints which are a beautiful shimmery we've got shell 12 and blush 44 
This one is Shell. It's like a beautiful, creamy, like look at the color of that. Absolutely gorgeous little shimmer for the eyes. Nothing too glittery, it's just a real nice shimmer. This one is the blush, so a bit pinkier. I'll show you them side by side. Some gorgeous shades there. I feel like I might um, just do a little swatch so that you can see what they come out like. So they literally just blend beautifully. I mean, how nice is that? I'm gonna leave these links because I feel like you guys will really enjoy them. They're just so easy to use. There's no faffing. It's just a simple cream product that you can blend even just with your fingers. They knew me so well. So thank you to Giorgio Armani Beauty for sending me those. And that's everything. So we have loads. I appreciate that. Like I said, it is Christmas and birthday kind of rolled into one. Anything else I do get for my birthday, whether I go shopping, treat myself or get anything else, I will do a kind of a bit of a birthday vlog in the new year. That might even be my next video. So they're either going to be that or a kind of Probably more likely it's gonna be a bit of a new year reset type video whereby we get the house in order for the new year, take all the decorations down, have a bit of a clean and show you what I have planned for the upcoming new year. But yeah, otherwise, thank you so, so much for watching today's video. Thank you so much to each and every one of you for all of your support this year. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I will look forward to seeing you in 2024. I hope you all have a lovely rest of your few days, New Year's plans, whatever you've got planned. Just be kind to yourself as we ease back into what can be for some people a hard month. So hopefully I will bring you lots of wholesome content throughout January and February to just sit back, relax and enjoy. And yeah, so we can avoid any January blues. I personally love January. I love a fresh, clean start. I'm looking forward to doing that new year and reset vlog. So stay tuned for that. And yeah, above all, just want to say a big, big thank you. Congratulations to all of the giveaway winners that I chose last, well, I chose a couple of days ago and those bits will be being sent out to you guys shortly, all the winners. And anyone that didn't win but entered, stay tuned for more because it's definitely something I want to do more in the new year. Probably more so on Instagram as well, like just thrown in random um, I've seen quite a lot of people get the um, do little giveaways on their broadcast channel, which I haven't set up yet. Let me know if you guys use Instagram broadcasts. It's, I feel like there's always new stuff, new new platforms, new things to try and learn and use. And I haven't jumped on that bandwagon yet. But if you do use it, let me know. And yeah, thank you so so much. And I will hope to see you all very soon in 2024. Bye guys.